Now it's Wednesday, which means Sarah Thornton has been visiting another place in the southeast, nominated by you, so that she can put it on her map. This week, she's in the beautiful Elam Valley at a vineyard which does far more than just make wine. With its chalky soil and temperate climate, Kent is renowned for its more than 50 vineyards, where conditions are ripe for making English wines. But amongst the vines in the Downs is a producer with a difference. In the village of Barham is the Elam Valley Vineyard, run by the Fifth Trust Charity. It's looking tidier, isn't it? Then we need to look to see if there's any more little buds. Jane Ward is a long-time villager and new recruit at the Fifth Trust. I used to be a customer, come along to the cafe. I love the spot by the vineyard. The Fifth Trust is very lucky to be part of a really supportive community in Barham. The charity supports 150 learning disabled adults who come here through the week as students and take part in activities ranging from pottery and photography to crafts and gardening and also work in the social enterprises, the vineyard, the garden centre and the cafe, gaining valuable life skills and experience. When people come here at the weekend, when the students aren't on site, they just think we're a commercial operation. But if you look closely, you'll see um, in the garden centre, we have ceramics that the students make. Um, and in the cafe, we have uh, jams and chutneys that they make in Cook Club. And they also make a lot of our cakes and scones and quiches. That's it, and this one can go. Ben helps in the vineyard okay, and delivers logs, while also taking music lessons yeah. and woodwork. And the care team at the Fifth Trust even recently helped him to prepare for a short speech at a family wedding. You pick the buds off and then you're hoping to make what out of the grapes? Wine. And have you tested any of the wine? No. <laughs> no, thank you. In the years Charlie has been coming here, her communication skills have flourished. She tells me she previously struggled to talk to new people, but her work at the vineyard has changed all that. The cafe I love because I get to communicate with loads of different people, get to know what they like, so you get to see them every single time. It's quite nice. I'm hoping to stay here for a long time. When it's time to harvest the grapes, they make a day of it. All the students, staff and volunteers pick the fruit and it's taken to a winery just a few miles away. But for all that's on offer to the public, it's the close-knit community spirit of the Fifth Trust that the charity is most proud of. Come and see us, come and see what we do. We'd love to welcome you here. Like one big happy family. <laughs>